Today, we're gonna to be taking a driving tour around Pickering's city center neighborhood to give you an idea of what this neighborhood has to offer and see if it's the right fit for you and your family. Hey, my name is Mitch. I'm a local realtor here in Pickering and I make videos just like this to let families know what living in Pickering is all about. Now, if you're new here and find these types of videos helpful, go ahead and click on that subscribe button so you can stay up to date when future videos come out. The city center neighborhood is bound to the north by the rear properties fronting Kingston Road, to the west where Kingston Road and Highway 401 meet, to the south by Bailey Street, and to the east by the Hydro Transmission Corridor. Since the 1980s, medium to high density residential developments have been built east of Glenanna Road. Of the almost 2200 occupied homes in the neighborhood, the most common type is apartments at 75%. Centrally located in Pickering, City Center includes the City Hall, the Public Library, the Rec Center, the Pickering Town Center, restaurants, shopping plazas, and the GO Station. Now here's just a quick map of where we'll be driving today, just to give you some reference to where we'll be throughout the drive. Now with that, let's get right into the drive tour of Pickering's city center neighborhood. So we're just starting off here in the northwestern corner of the city center neighborhood. And right away, you can see the first commercial plaza straight ahead, has a part source, a Dairy Queen, Perkins, and there's a lot more in there as well. Now continuing along this plaza, you can see the paramedic services building there to the right. You can also see the shoppers. Back there, there's a Home Depot, there's a Michaels, and there's some more restaurants. And now at the back corner of that plaza, if you were to take a right at this intersection, there's a Food Basics grocery store as well. Now passing to our right is the Loblaws with a Good Life Gym connected to it as well. And on the left, just out of the frame there, there's a Tim Hortons and a convenience store. And then also on the left, right at the intersection there, is the Liverpool Pub, which is also an old historic building. Now coming up to the intersection here at Liverpool and Kingston Road, you can see two different commercial plazas. You have the one on our left and the one on our right. Now the left plaza has a McDonald's, there's a Starbucks, a convenience store, and the Pacific Food Market along with other stores. And the one just passing on our right, you can see the Moxie's, there's a Pickle Barrel restaurant, and you can see a little bit of the Pickering Town Center there, which also has a VIP movie theater. Now passing over Glenanna here is the Sheridan Veterinary to our left as well as the Viva Retirement Community. Also to our left just before we make this turn onto Valley Farm Road you can see another plaza with all kinds of amazing restaurants in there. Now if you were to continue straight on Kingston Road, it would take you to the Village East neighborhood and I'll link that drive tour of that neighborhood in the cards above and you can watch that tour after if you're interested.
Now on Valley Farm here, we're going to be taking a left onto Avonmore Square. Now Avonmore has a mix of detached homes and row homes that were built in the early 2000s. So I'll just follow the square along just to give you an idea of what some of the houses look like here. Now here we're back out to Valley Farm Road where we'll take a left. And to our left there is the rec center which includes a gym, it has a pool and it has all kinds of programs and activities for every age. Now here we'll be taking a right onto the Esplanade where we'll be passing the Esplanade Park on our left there. And in the summer they have concerts every Sunday afternoon at 2 p.m. in the gazebo there for everyone to come and watch. And up ahead you can see the Pickering City Hall and Public Library. And straight ahead you can kind of get a better view of the Pickering Town Center there. Now we're out at Glenana Road again, where we'll be taking a left. And we'll be passing in front of the Pickering City Hall. To our right, this is where the old Sears used to be, and this area is designated to be redeveloped with a performing arts center, a youth and senior center, there's going to be a public space, and a new central library there as well. And to our left is the newly constructed Amica Retirement Home. And then up ahead you can see the new Universal City condos being constructed where the old Art Thompson Hockey Arena used to be. And we'll drive past that development in the Bay Ridges neighborhood drive tour. Here we'll just be taking a right onto Pickering Parkway and following this road along until we get to Liverpool Road. Up ahead you can see the VIP Cineplex that I mentioned before there. Now straight ahead, across Liverpool Road, that's where you can access the Loblaws Plaza as well. And 
that Liverpool here will be taking a left. To our right there, Liverpool has a westbound 401 on-ramp there that you can jump on. And as we come up to the 401, this is the southern boundary for the city center neighborhood, and that will wrap up the drive tour. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment or send me an email. I'll have my email down in the description there. I hope you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.